the ball everyone's been talking about, the new blue hammer, not urethane. What's up guys, Brunsnick's back. The new blue hammer is supposed to revolutionize urethane-like ball motion, especially on the PBA Tour, since purple hammers will no longer be used in PBA competition. USB-C, still legal. Use all your purple hammers all you want. But today, I'm going to see what this ball does on the lanes for me, with Specto running, of course. But before we get to all that, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Now, let's see what not urethane does for me. Alright, we're here at Brunswick HQ because, I don't know if you guys know, I'm a Brunswick employee, have been for a long time. So, I mean, the private center didn't give it away, maybe the million dollar throw butt machine, maybe the cool Brunswick B on the wall. But anyway, we're here to talk about Not Your Thing, New Blue Hammer, exciting release, a lot of talk, a lot of speculation about what the cover stock is, the core is pretty self-explanatory. It's the core from the Purple Hammer Solid. It's got the 2.587, 2.586, somewhere in there, 027 differential. A lot of talk right now. Is this going to be the replacement for Purple Hammer on the PBA Tour? Since the, the Tour started at a hardness level of 78, you know, you can't use Purple Hammer starting in 2024. And your USB-C leagues, still legal. Use all the Purple Hammers you want. So I'm here to test out this ball. I haven't thrown a single shot with it, but I want to look at a few things, what it does. You know, I'm not going to probably play way deep and throw it out, but we're going to see a few things if they share some attributes to one another. And the first is the ball hooks like crazy on the first shot. Purple Hammer always hooks like crazy the first shot and it mellows out. So let's try it. I've warmed up a little bit, but let's go. First shot with the badass blue, not urethane. Yeah, hooks a little bit. <laughs> Four count right out of the gate. So obviously I missed it in a little bit. A little bit rusty this morning, getting here a little early, but now the true test will be, let's look at how much it flares here. We do get a little bit of flare with the 027 diff compared to Purple Hammer, where it had a lower uh, differential. And that's because just the, the, the specific gravity of urethane versus resin changes the numbers of the dynamics of the core. So that's what we're seeing here. Let's do shot two. Let's try not to miss that one in, huh? Let's just try to get it out into a urethane type. I thought that was gonna hook immediately. I got that to the dry a little bit, but held pocket. Did its thing. Now we're bowling on Crown Jewel. Typical house shot, what, 42, 43 foot, 13 to 1 ratio. Big gush in the middle. Plenty of dry outside. So right off the gate, it's promising, right? You know, it's set up, but it didn't overreact. Okay, how does it feel? Still feels good. It doesn't feel slimy. That's another thing we're going to talk about in this video. Let's throw another shot here. Now I'm getting really warmed up. Oh, baby. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. First impression is absolutely 100% this could be a viable option if you can't throw Purple Hammer. If Purple Hammer is not allowed on PBA Tour, I'm telling you what, these guys are going to figure it out with this ball. So, uh, am I impressed so far? Yes. Absolutely. Let's do it again. Make sure it's not a fluke. And then we'll talk about how oil affects urethane versus resin. And we're going to talk about a little bit about oil absorption, too. Got a hook. Yeah, okay. That's about what to be expected when you kind of miss it in the oil a little bit. So, you know, it's so important to wipe oil off the ball, especially like urethane. You know, you really got to lean into it and really got to keep it clean because the oil gets into the peaks and valleys. You need a really good chamois to clean it off. 
the new blue is going to be less susceptible to that kind of interference with oil because it's not urethane. So what kind of cover is it? Well, it's not urethane. It is obviously a proprietary blend of a cover stock that absorbs oil at a very, very slow pace, but fast enough to not be considered urethane by the current rules. All right, let's throw another shot here. That's pretty good. Get that out of there. Nothing hits like a hammer. Nothing carries like a hammer. Not urethane, new blue hammer. You carry those off hits. I think I'm gonna move a little bit right right now. I'm gonna get this ball into the dry more and let it kind of set up early. You know, right there, it's kind of laboring a little bit in the oil, so let's get it started. You know, it's urethane-like, urethane-type reactions. You want that ball to start up early. We're talking like 30, 35 feet. I'm gonna move three right with my feet and my eyes will follow. So this is just a parallel move. <laughs> Four count again. Yep. All right, that's two. Maybe uh, this is replacing my nine pins and eight pins. All right, so three and three was too much. I'm gonna back my feet back left a little bit. I'm just gonna open my eyes a little bit. How about that? We're just gonna move my eyes right. We get my feet back in the same spot as before. Obviously the ball sets up early. That almost held pocket. So I'm gonna get my eyes right, get it to the dry a little bit. Way too much. Oh. <laughs> Hello, window. Threw it out of there. Yeah, that was completely out the window. I mean, Specto running, so let's see what board it is, but if I had to guess, two, two board, but didn't overreact, but it got back. Man, all right, not a great shot. Let's try it a little bit better. You can always do better than that. Come on, let's get this ball broken in. Yes, oh my goodness. I'm gonna say this right now. If you're on the fence about, oh, I might order, I might wait till it comes out. I'm telling you, pre-order this ball. There's gonna be so much activity with this ball. People are gonna want this ball. It's gonna be hard to get if you don't push your pre-order in. I'm telling you that right now. I'm not saying that we're gonna go on back order, but I'm saying that there is a chance that certain shops won't have access to them because their distributors have to order more. So get your orders in now, force, everybody to have to order more because this is going to be the hottest ball of the year especially in the last quarter here oh i'm feeling it now ah oh, bad break yep starting to get some confidence with this ball for sure and of course everybody's going to want to know what does the new blue hammer compare to the purple hammer and I'm gonna show you in another video. So be sure to stay tuned for another video coming out later in the week, possibly next week. But I will show an in-depth review, heads up, side by side. So we're probably about seven, eight shots in. You know, there's no real glazing oil. It doesn't get slimy, you know, like true urethane balls do. But that's what we're gonna see. That's another advantage we're gonna talk about. Oh, goodness gracious. Yeah, I mean, how many of you guys, I mean, it's a lot of you that throw purple hammer, you know, and as you bowl and bowl and bowl, you tend to move a little bit closer to the gutter. You know, you have to move right for right handers, left for you know, lefties, because, you know, the, the ball picks up oil, it's not gonna react as much. You're not gonna have that issue, especially, say you need three hits in the 10th. You know, you gotta wipe off your ball between each shot 
it's not going to be affected by that as much. That's a, a, such a huge advantage. Now we got a ball that mimics purple hammer in response and motion. A little slower. Oh, yes. I'm going to say absolutely. For fun, I'm going to move in a little bit, give it a little bit of bend. It's not something I typically do with urethane, especially purple hammer. I'm not hooking it. Very rare will you see me get left and try to hook it. But since this is not urethane, this is badass blue, let's move in. I'm going to move, let's move 10. I'm going to move 10. I'm just going to try to slow wheel it. I'm just going to see what it does. Not bad. <laughs> would, I, would I go to that shot normally? No, probably not. But it wasn't bad. All right, I'm going to move a little bit more because uh, I like to test the limits on bowling balls. You know, obviously this ball is designed to play straighter, more control. Yeah, it's going to take a minute to come back from the ball return here, but I'm willing to try it, hooking it. Once in a while, you get on a longer pattern where a slow hook and it does work. I have done that with purple. It's not my favorite play. It's kind of a bailout. All right, I moved another five. Let's keep the speed down. It's pretty slow and smooth. I would say that it is better playing open angles like that if you need it but it is fantastic playing straight. I'm gonna move one more five board increment here. This is usually where I end the video. I don't know how well this is gonna work out. We'll see. <laughs> yeah! The new blue can do everything. I'm gonna throw a couple more shots. We're gonna move it back right. Let's get serious. Let's give the high hard one out in the dry. I'm gonna do a little re-rack action here. Don't like that rack. So slow hooking it. So that tells me your slower speed, maybe rev dominant. You like to hook the whole lane, but you have everything re overreact. This could be it, man. This could be your ball. All right. I'm moving way right. Well, right, righter, where I went to the face, but I'm gonna throw some harder cheese. Yeah. That's where I like playing urethane the most. I'm always gonna try to get closest to the gutter if possible. I don't care what I'm bowling on, house shot, sports shot. If I got the gutter in play, I'm gonna play out there. That's, our, that's for damn sure. All right, let's throw one more and we'll wrap this up. This has been a phenomenal video. Hope you guys have enjoyed. If you haven't, please subscribe. All right, one more. High heat. All right, beautiful shot. That thing sets up perfect. I'm telling you, Purple Hammer fans, you just want this ball because it's hammer, badass blue, rolls like purple hammer. It's gonna give you that urethane-like option without being urethane. Fantastic ball. If you have any questions or comments about it, please put them down below. Please subscribe. Talk to you guys later.